This announcement is for all Christ as of old ministry. I received them from above and God said we should stand while listening to them. This is a letter to Christ as of old ministry from the Lord. He says, read by, tell them that each of every of them should say it, that I am predestined to be a testimonial. He said, every as of old members are predestined to be a testimony in this month. He says, you are the head. I asked him why. He said, you are the head. I repeat. He said, read by, tell all as of old members that I am predestined to be a testimonial. He said, e every as of old member are predestined to be a testimony. You are the head and not the tail. He gave me Romans 8, verse 30. He said, by divine power, Christ has given to us all things that pertain to life and godliness. 2 Peter 1, verse 3. He said, as God sanctified Jesus on this earth, so Jesus has sanctified you on this earth also. John 17, 18 to 19. He said, for you to be a living proof of testimony, you must have the spirit of expectation. Proverbs 24, 13 to 14. He said, I should tell you, that lack of expectation leads one to frustration. He said, if you are hopeless, you, if you are hopeful, sorry, you'll be blessful. He said, what you don't imagine, you don't manifest. He said, what you don't hope for, you don't receive. He said, without hope, faith cannot fertilize anything. Hope is a wife of faith, and faith is the husband of hope. If you come together, they fertilize to give birth to your testimony. So therefore, every class of old ministry must receive his or her testimony in this month of November. I heard him clear. He said, Rita Bai, starting from you, whatsoever that you have sacrificed for in the name of the Lord, that this year you will receive all your sons, your daughters in the house will receive. That everyone tears that have been mocked, everyone that man has mocked, that says, can anything good come out from you? He said, read a by, starting from you, they will see the manifestation of my hand in the name of Jesus Christ. This is a letter to Christ as of old members. When God speaks, no one can change it. How will it come to pass if you are hopeful? If you are hopeful, in every situation, give him praise. Don't love God with any condition. Love God unconditionally. Once you love God unconditionally, he blesses you. Use the already read by as an example. When rough was getting rough, he loved God. When things were tougher, he loved God. When situation of storms came, he loved God. When things were so hard, he loved God the more. Many things has happened to me that if it happened to others, their faith will lose. But I want to use me as a standard. The more you glorify God in that your situation, the more he remember you and keep you in his diary. Look up here. So many things that will manifest for those that believe are those that have patience, endurance, and hope. Finances might not be there now. That does not mean it will not be there tomorrow. The more you glorify God when you have things, the more you are trying to tell him you are wiser than him. And no man is wiser than God. Thank you.